يسعدنا ان نرحب بكم جميعا في حفل اليوم حفل نهايه العام لاكاديميه خطاب الموسيقى. حفلنا هذا هو مناسبه خاصه جدا بالنسبه لنا، فنحن هنا للاحتفاء وتكريم الانجازات المتميزه والعمل الجاد الذي بذله طلابنا ومعلمونا وبيئه الامور على مدار العام. على الرغم من الصعوبات التي فرضها الوباء الحالي وظروف التعلم عن بعد، عملت عائلة الأكاديمية بإخلاص وتفان على تطوير معاييرها التعليمية العالية والارتقاء بجودة التعليم الموسيقي بشكل مستمر وكل عام أكثر وأكثر. وبعد 11 عاما من العمل المؤلم والجهود الجبارة، يمكننا القول بثقة أن أكاديمية خطر الموسيقى قد رسخت معايير التعليم والبحث الموسيقي الاحترافي في خطر المنطقة. لن نطيل الحديث. فنحن جميعا نترقب هذا اليوم لنحصل باداء متميز ورائع لطلبتنا، لكننا نود فقط ان نتعاقب على اهم الاحداث والتطورات التي تقدمناها ونحن على ابواب نهايه عام الدراسي 2020 2021 2022. منذ ثلاث سنوات بدات اكاديميه استعداداتها للطلب العضويه من واحده من اكبر واعرق مؤسسات تعليم الموسيقى الاحترافيه في اوروبا، رابطه المعاهد الموسيقيه الاوروبيه ومدارس الموسيقى اي اي سي. هذه المنظمة تضع معايير وأنظمة التعليم الموسيقي ما قبل الجامعي والتعليم الموسيقي العالي، ليس فقط في أوروبا ولكن في جميع أنحاء العالم. يسعدنا إعلامكم أنه في سبتمبر من العام الماضي تم قبول الأكاديمية كعضو رسمي في رابطة المعاهد الموسيقية الأوروبية من قبل مجلس أي إي سي. ومرة أخرى في سبتمبر من العام نفسه أصبحت الأكاديمية ممثلا رسميا للمجلس المشترك لمدارس الموسيقى الملكية البريطاني أي بي إر إس إم في قطر. بالإضافة إلى تعاوننا الدولي المتزايد، وقعت أكاديمية ممثلة بقسم الموسيقى العربية مذكرة تفاهم مع واحدة من أهم المعاهد الموسيقية في أوروبا، كونزرفاتوريو ديلا سيتيرا إيطاليانا سي إس أي، المعهد العالي للموسيقى في لوغانو سويسرا. هذه الاتفاقية ستمكن كلا المؤسستين من تطوير مبادرات مشتركة لطلاب التعليم الموسيقي ما قبل الجامعي. وستؤسس رابطا قويا لمشاريع مستقبليه وورش عمل وحفلات موسيقيه دوليه مشتركه. بصفتها مركز بحوث وتعليم الموسيقى في قطر، فان الاكاديميه تسعى بشكل حثيث لنشر الوعي والتقدير للفنون الموسيقيه التقليديه في المنطقه. وبفضل الجهود المستمره والتفاني الدائم لقسم الموسيقى العربيه، قامت الاكاديميه ببناء جسور تعاون مع جميع مدارس مؤسسه قطر، والتي تعمل تحت مظله التعليم ما قبل الجامعي. فقد انشا القسم العربي مجموعه خاصة تضم جميع مدرسي الموسيقى في مدارس المؤسسة. تلتقي هذه المجموعة بشكل دوري لتبادل الأفكار والخطط وتطوير مناهج تعليم الموسيقى العربية والغربية في مدارس المؤسسة. ونتيجة لذلك نال القسم العربي جائزة التقدير للتعليم ما قبل الجامعي لمساهمته الاستثنائية في التعاون عبر مدارس المؤسسة وفي بناء الوعي والتقدير للموسيقى في قطر والمنطقة. من جهة أخرى وبعد أربع سنوات من العمل الجاد تم الانتهاء من منهج جديد للموسيقى يغطي ويضع تصورا كاملا لجميع جوانب الموسيقى النظريه والتاريخ الموسيقي والتحليل والسولفيج والتاليف للموسيقى الغربيه والعربيه. وبكل فخ نود اعلامكم بانه تم نشر كتاب الموسيقى في شبه الجزيره العربيه كنتيجه للمؤتمر الاول الذي نظمه قسم الموسيقى العربيه في ابريل 2014 وما تلاه من مؤتمرات وندوات لاحقه تحت عنوان موسيقى واغاني الخليج في القرن العشرين. وقد حصلت الأكاديمية على النسخة الأولى منه. وقد قمنا أيضا بافتتاح قسم جديد في الأكاديمية وهو قسم الجيتار، والآن نقبل الطلاب جدد العام الدراسي القادم، وتم أيضا إنشاء صفوف مجموعة القانون والعود وتقدم الآن تعليما موسيقيا لعشاق الموسيقى في أي مستوى وفي أي عمر. على الرغم من افتقار الأكاديمية لمس الأكاديمية لمسرح خاص بها لتقديم العروض الموسيقية الكبيرة، وبالإضافة إلى اللوائح الصارمة لوزارة الصحة العامة، فقد نجح قسمان الموسيقى العربية والغربية في تقديم 65 عرضا وفعالية عامة و24 ورشة عمل على مدار العام الدراسي. لن نأتي على ذكرها الآن لضيق الوقت. نتقدم بخلص الامتنان لجميع أفراد أسرة الأكاديمية وجميع داعميها وتقديرنا العميق لطلابنا وأولياء الأمور الذين كانوا البناة والمساهمين والمهندسين لهذا العام الرائع. ندعوكم الآن للانضمام إلينا لتهنئة فنانين المستقبل والإشادة بإنجازاتهم العظيمة. ودعونا نستمتع ونشاهد الاداء المتميز لطلبتنا شكرا جزيلا لكم Good evening honorable directors honorable guests uh, our colleagues students and uh, of course honored parents end of year ceremony is a very special occasion for us 
where we recognize and celebrate a year-long hard work, dedication, and outstanding achievements of our students, our teachers, and of course, our students' parents. Despite the limitation of the current pandemic and distance learning, QMA family continuously improves its high standards and advances its quality of education progressively every year more and more. After our 11 years of dedicated works and efforts, we can confidently state that the QMA sets the standards of professional music education and research around the region as today. We will not occupy this beautiful ceremony and upcoming magnificent performances with long speeches. We just would love to share with you one of the most important highlights in the developments of 2021 and 2022 academic year. First, uh, three years ago, QMA has started its preparation to request membership from the one of the largest and the most prestigious organization in the professional music education. It is Association of European Conservatories and Music Schools, AEC. The organization that sets the standards of pre-college music education and the higher music education not only in Europe, but all around the globe. At the beginning of this academic year, in September 2021, QMA is officially accepted to the Association of European Conservatories by the AEC Council. And again, in June 2021, we have requested a BRSM international representative role for QMA. And in September 2021, QMA has officially become the representative of a BRSM for Qatar. In addition to our increased international collaborations, QMA has signed an MOU with one of the most important conservatories in Europe, Conservatorio della Svizzera Italiana, Lugano, Switzerland. Agreement enables both institutions to develop and to share initiatives in pre-college music education and establishes a strong link uh, for international masterclasses, workshops, concerts, and events. As the Center of Music Education and Research in Qatar, QMA is responsible of establishing awareness and appreciation for musical arts around the region. Thanks to uh, QMA, Arab Music Department's continuous efforts and dedication, QMA has built strong bridges with all QF schools which operate under PUE umbrella. AMD has initiated PUE Music Teachers Focus Group, which is a unique platform to align music teachers in all QF schools exchange ideas, plans, and develop both Arab and Western music education in Qatar. As a result, AMD was awarded the PUE School Awards for their exceptional contribution to collaboration across QF schools and to build awareness and appreciation of music in Qatar and the region. After four years of dedicated works and efforts, new musicianship curriculum that fully covers and conceptualizes all aspects of music as theory, history, analysis, solfege, and composition for both Western and Arab music department has been successfully completed. Music in Arabia book has been published and QMA has received the first copy. Music in Arabia is a result of the first symposium that the Arab music department organized in April 2014, Arabian Gulf music and the songs during 20th century. A new instrument has joined to QMA uh, guitar department is established and now is accepting students for the next academic year, for your information. Canon and Oud group classes are established and now offers music education to music enthusiasts to any level at any age. Despite the lack of performance space and the strict regulation of Minister of Public Health, QMA West Star Music Department and Arab Music Department have successfully presented 65 public events and performances, 24 workshops and master classes throughout the academic year. Our sincere gratitude to all QMA family and to all QMA supporters and to our deepest appreciation for our students and of course for their parents. Thank you very much, enjoy the concert.
dear guests, we shall pause for a couple of minutes for the Al Maghreb prayer. Thank you for your understanding.
Good evening, our honorable directors, dear parents, guardians, teachers, students, ladies and gentlemen. Today, I feel very honored, privileged and proud to stand before you and acknowledge all our individual and collective achievements. We have all faced great challenges enforced us on by the pandemic, but we have proved that we can protect ourselves through unifying efforts. We have learned that through hard work and collaboration as one united family of parents, staff, faculty, administrators, and students, we are able to continue providing high quality music education even during these challenging times. We have been resilient and strong, our strengths coming from our unique, distinctive, and diverse cultural and learning environments. A diversity which gives our students a great opportunity to explore and experience music from different cultures. We cherish our diversity while actively promoting cultural exchanges and unity. This message was clearly demonstrated tonight through the music performed by Master Takt, our choir, choirs and Kata Youth Orchestra. You've heard about our faculty achievements from Dr. Osgur Essen, head of Western Music Department, and Mr. Taufik Mirhan, head of Arab Music Department. But we are also here to celebrate individual achievements and to say goodbye to those of our students who are leaving Qatar, having studied at QME for some considerable time. First, let us recognize our students for their academic music excellence and service to the school. Outstanding student achievements awards are presented to the following students. Adra, Jitesh, Noor, Khalid, Abel Majid, Sasha, Salame, Paul Gete, Shan Lo, Gyu Ryan Lee, Ram Alani, and Tolin Abu Haab. Promising Young Musicians Awards, please welcome to stage the following. Sarah Tang, Clara Horetsky, Adriana Chami, Eva Julie Renault, Anthony Bolhab, Nasir Mansour Jenkir, Ahmed Aljida, Yara Kasser, Yazan Saoub, and Yusuf Hanafi. Outstanding service awards are going to go to Alicia Lee Chen, Javad Jebek, Shun Funeno, Aju, Hafush, Kenza Obeid, Aziz Dayoub, Leo Fayad. Director's award goes to Georgina Harris as a leader of the Qatar Youth Orchestra and the PUE awarded for outstanding student goal to Sultan Al Nama.
Congratulations to all our winners. We couldn't let this special occasion pass without saying goodbye to our students' leavers. It is vital that we take opportunity to say a fond farewell and proper thank you before they go. So, as a small token of our appreciation and to remind them of all their times at QMA, please welcome on stage the following students. Jemima Hodgson, Alicia Lee, Tara Tafrey, Adra Jitesh and Noor Abdelmajid. Georgina Harris, Audrey Hafush, Adam Nahar Hashim Hrishan, Tulin Name, Kaltan Al Suwaidi, Liv Judith Bue, Shun Funeno, Arabella Nadine Tanita, Sara Dood, Zina Sadez, and Javad Jebek. To our leavers, just look forward and go ahead to see the world, knowing that our warm wishes are always with you. Use your power to make other people happy and keep a strong belief in yourself. Go on to make your name, fame and money and come back to tell us about your success stories. And don't forget to continue enjoying music through singing and playing. Thank you. We would also like to say thank you and goodbye to Miss Maria Medvedeva, our violin teacher who is relocating from Qatar to Switzerland. This <laughs> this concert would not be possible without help from Qatar's Opera House and QPO, who were happy for us to use their equipment and technicians. We are grateful for your help. May I also give a heartfelt thanks to Qatar Foundation PUE for their guidance and unconditional support to our cause. I would like us to express my heartiest gratitude to QMA teaching and admin staff for their support and collective efforts towards the development of our students. Last, but by no means least, I would like to extend my gratitude towards our parents who continue to provide a consistent support system throughout the children's education journey. Our sincere thanks for your supporting us in all our endeavors. Your words of appreciation keep us motivated to do more and better. Thank you. <laughs> it's only fitting that we finish this evening with music. Our final piece tonight is called A Walk in Sukh Vakiv. A Walk in Sukh Vakiv is a suite of four Qatari traditional songs arranged by the composer Mayas Alemani. He's here tonight. Could we please uh, allow us? Could you have to stand up for that?
Mayas has arranged this for Takt and Katai Youth Orchestra. So Vakif is gorgeous paradise for those who wish to experience the true essence of shopping the traditional way in Qatar. The music evokes all the senses as it transports us to the unique and iconic landmark. Imagine, if you will, its atmosphere, architecture, colors, sounds, and the perfume of its aromatic spices. I sincerely hope that you will enjoy this piece. Maestro Passini, take it away. Thank you. <laughs> 